Alright guys, welcome back, and this video, what we're going to do is, well, I'll show you guys. So right now, our dude has a gun, but whenever he shoots a monster, the bullet just goes right over top of him, nothing happens. And what we want to happen is, of course, it kills the monster with a cool little explosion, why the heck not? So in order to do that, we need to add another event, basically saying, when the bullet hits the monster, the monster destroys and an explosion happens. So, if we add an event, what we can do uh, is we can, oh my god, what is wrong with me? As soon as I start making these tutorials, you know, it, it just feels like I drank like 18 milkshakes, all the phlegm in my throat. But basically, what we want to check out for is something to happen to this bullet. So go ahead and double click the bullet, and the exact um, event name is on collision with another object so on collision with another object and we're basically saying okay you wanna see if the bullet collides with something well what do you wanna see it if it collides with well the monster so this event that is checking for is when the bullet collides with the monster and now we just gotta say what happens well we actually wanna have a couple different things happen and the first thing is this we want the object of the monster to be destroyed. So monster destroyed. That's pretty straightforward. Now we also want the bullet. So we'll click bullet next to spawn another object. So we, whenever the monster, or excuse me, whenever the bullet hits the monster, we want the explosion object to appear right where that bullet was because that's where the explosion happens. So if we go to spawn another object, the object is the explosion, and I'll slow it down a little bit. The layer is one, basically we don't want it to happen on the background, but on the main layer, and the image point, we can just go ahead and leave it zero because you're not gonna be able to tell the difference between the middle of the bullet and the tip of it because they're like a pixel apart. So click done. And the last action that we wanna um, make occur is the bullet itself gets destroyed. So click bullet and scroll all the way down and under miscellaneous click destroy and hit done. So what we basically did is we said okay when the bullet collides with the monster a couple of things are gonna happen. First of all the monster is destroyed because they got shot. Second of all there's gonna be an explosion at that point of impact and also the bullet gets destroyed because you know you're not gonna have an explosion and then the bullet keeps going so now let's go ahead and run this and check it out what happens okay so it shot the monster the monster disappeared the bullet disappeared and if I start that again you see that explosion but first of all that explosion looked kind of weird because in this explosion image that we have there's like a black um like a black background on it so we can go ahead and actually get rid of that in the game we don't need um, a photo editor program to get rid of that and I'm gonna show you guys how to do that in the next video so the next video is actually gonna be probably pretty quick we'll get rid of this black ugly background on the explosion and I'll also show you guys how to make your monsters a little bit smarter so they come toward your guy instead of just going it all in a straight line like they're in some you know idiotic military or something so thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you then.